My grandfather, John A. Medassi, was born in 1876 in a small village called Foro, Hungary. Around 1900, he immigrated to the U.S. through Ellis Island, and he eventually ended up in Youngstown, Ohio. Right around 1900, my grandmother, the former Teresa Kovach, married my grandfather, John A. Medassi, and here's a picture of their wedding day. Regarding where my grandfather was born, Foro is situated in the northeastern part of Hungary, very close to the Slovakian border. The nearest large city to Foro is a town called Miskolc. There's not a lot of industry around Foro, but there is a lot of agriculture. The light becomes a atlas to get home. Several years ago, my brother David and Jack, along with Donna and myself, went to Foro to see if we could visit the church that my grandfather may have attended to see if there were any records regarding the Medassi family. We weren't able to go through the record books at the time because the priest from that parish was updating all the old record books because they were in such terrible condition. We were, however, able to find a cemetery, which was not too far from the church, and we located several tombstones with the Medassi name on it. It was really, really interesting and a little bit, well, a little bit spooky at the time. There will be a lot more about my grandfather in later movie clips. There seems to be some mystery regarding exactly where he's buried in the Calvary Cemetery back in Youngstown, Ohio. And the real mystery is that my grandmother may have been married twice, as I recently came across a picture given to me by my cousin Terry of my grandmother and my grandfather in 1922, which is four years after John A. Medassi passed away. So why is it that my father never, ever, ever mentioned that his mother, our grandmother, may have been married twice? I was no 